Pace sprinting away from the 1200 meter marker. In the centre of the track, Amiga Onslaught with the green blinkers began well. New Hampshire's right there. Wilbur has the white blinkers. Landcat is on the stand side with the white cap. New Hampshire's about a length and a half off them with Albuquerque. And then comes Roy's Express. That's in the middle of your picture with the orange cap. Extreme left is Seattle Light. They're followed further back by Gold Chest. And then comes Stormatic. As they move to the 600 meter marker and Protea Power and Amiga Onslaught, Landcats there with the white cap, then Stormatic. Roy's Express is over on the inside. New Hampshire comes out for a run. Gold Chest is towards the center of the track and Wilbur on the inside. As they come down to the last 300 meters now and Protea Power takes it up. New Hampshire, Landcat, Amiga Onslaught on the inside. Stormatic also tries to get into the race, but it's Protea Power who hit the front. New Hampshire, Amiga Onslaught on the inside, then Stormatic. Protea Power still goes though. And it's Protea Power from New Hampshire over the last hundred. Nothing in it. New Hampshire's coming powerfully now. New Hampshire got up to win it. Second Protea Power, Amiga Onslaught and Stormatic. Number one, New Hampshire is victorious. Sat towards the outside, just stalked them, comes around and tackles Protea Power. You'll see he gets eased up at the line eventually to win a half length, ends up tote favourite at 270, New Hampshire. Second, number five, Protea Power, paid up 320 a players. Third position, it's about three lengths back to the third place horse, Amiga Onslaught, that's number three, it paid up at two rand, and then Stormatic, tote favourite was the winner, number one. Uh, fourth was to 11, Stormatic, and then further back, Landcat, Seattle Light, as we continue to run it, Wilbur is further back in the running. And then came Gold Chest, and Roy's Express. So as we look at the head-on, the winner is on the extreme right-hand side, and that's New Hampshire who comes to tackle Protea Power. They match each other for a couple of strides, but the now gelded New Hampshire comes forward and then goes on to score from Protea Power and Amiga Onslaught on the inside. So for a while, it took a while to get to Protea Power. But as you'll see, Keegan Amelie actually eases the winner up just before the line to win about a half length. That's the running of the third race. Until race four, back to the studio. Well, it's a quick double uh, early in the card for the Dennis Dreyer team here. And well done to you, Den, who's watching in Cape Town. Uh, we miss you here in KZN, but uh, well done over the weekend as well with uh, Gathering Fame uh, winning that feature race. So uh, the stable doing well in Cape Town. And, you know, you know that horse well, Gathering Fame, and really nice to see a comeback to her best. Yeah, nice for her to get the, you know, the, the black type. And uh, it was blinkers on, I think, for the first time, Stu? Yeah, she's had cheek pieces and she, you know, she ran well enough in them here, but she never was quite getting there. So, you know, obviously the, the blinkers have helped it all there. Well, the boss will be happy the way things are going here in KZN. A double for the stable thus far. And uh, this horse looked to be the better of the two. Yeah, listen, the other fella ran well first, I'm sure, and he said he just hated the, the softer going today. But yeah, like Keegan said to him when uh, we did our interviews earlier, you know, he's had good form here at Scottsville down the straight. So um, we're just worried he might just need it coming back from his go off. But obviously, well done to Mrs. Slack and Volker Bost and Dennison. Thanks to Keeks. He looks to be a nice, sensible horse now after gelding as well. Yeah, no, he's also, you know, carry well done to her. She rides the most days. He can be a bit heady, but, you know, good luck to all of them. Well done, Stu. Thanks. Well played. Stuart Ferry again. Well done to you, Dennis Dreyer. Always nice to get a, you know, a chance with regards to uh, rides in a stable that, uh, you know, has their jockey. But when you, when you throw on a ride, it's nice to give off your best, which you've done here. Yeah, thanks, Deej. You know, um, Mr. Dreyer, Stewie and the whole team, they've been very good to me. And, um, yeah, when I get a chance, I, I try to ride for them, you know, and um, it's just, a, just an honour to ride for them. This horse, uh, he looked to go and fetch that other horse. At one stage of the game, I thought the other horse went at the right time. But when you asked him, he quickened nicely. Yeah, yeah, um, I think the softer going helped him today. And um, he's looking for 14 mile, this horse, you know. He's settled beautifully since the gelding. And, um, 
yeah, when I asked him the question, he really quickened well. We've been briefly discussing uh, the going on air and uh, really nice to see the horses fan out now instead of ducking middle to inside. Yeah, I must say well done to everyone, you know, for um, putting the initiative to put that rail up, you know. It gives every horse a fair chance. And, um, yeah, when I asked this horse on the outside, um, he, he really quickened well. Anything else from your side uh, later on this afternoon, Keegan? The big league in the last, he's been a bit disappointing, but um, in that type of field, he could run a place. Well played, well done, and I'm sure many punters will be buying your coke the next time you meet for getting them through this first leg of the pick six. Yeah, well, let's hope so. You know, just a big thank you to Mr. Dreyer back in Cape Town. Um, Mrs. Dreyer, thank you. Mr. Slack, and well done to Stewie down here. Well played. Thank you. That's it. Keegan DeMello here in race number one for the Dennis Dry Yard with number one, New Hampshire. If you caught this quartet, the numbers you'll need, one, five, three, and 11. That's the way they finish race number three. Coming up next, the start of the jackpot. That will be at 15.05, which is five past three.